Hi class, it's Mrs. Lawson. I'm so glad that you're here today for our math lesson. Today, we are going to be counting by 10. And I know that you know how to do that. It goes 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. It's so easy and I think it's a lot of fun. But we don't have to start at the number 10 to count by 10. We could start at any number and then count by 10. Hmm, I think we're going to count by 10, but we'll start at the number one. I can count by 10, it's fun, it's fun. I can count by 10 and I'll start at one. One, 11, 21, 31, 41, 51, 61, 71, 81, and 91. Did you count with me? I think that we can count by 10 and start at two. I can count by 10. Can you? Can you? I can count by 10 and I'll start at two. Two, 12, 22, 32, 42, 52, 62, 72, 82, and 92. What if we started at three? I can count by 10. A wee, a wee. I can count by 10 and I'll start at three. Three, 13, 23, 33, 43, 53, 63, 73, 83, 93. Did you do it? I'm sure you did. I think that we should count by 10 starting at four. I can count by 10 with numbers galore. I can count by 10 and we'll start at four. Four, 14, 24, 34, 44, 54, 64, 74, 84, and 94. Let's count by 10 again, but this time start with five. I can count by 10. For this, you should strive. I can count by 10 and I'll start at five. Five, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95. What would be the next number? 105. Do you know what the number would be after that? 115. Excellent job. Give yourself a little pat on the back for that. Learning to count by 10 is a wonderful thing to practice. It will help you adding by 10 and subtracting by 10. Today, you are gonna take some time practicing counting by 10, but starting at different numbers. And you can practice writing it as well. Have you noticed the pattern when you're counting by 10? Let's take a look at six. When you are counting by 10 starting at six, all of your numbers are going to end in six. We have six, 16, 26, 36, 46, 56, 66, 76, 86, and 96. All of the numbers in the ones place have a six at the end. And all of the numbers that are in the tens place, they follow a pattern. In the very first one, six, there isn't a number in the tens place. But look, then we have a one, then two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The numbers in our ten place follow a pattern. I know that you are going to do a wonderful job counting by 10 today, even if you start at a different number, not 10. And I know that you're going to do a wonderful job practicing your writing counting by 10 as well. I hope that you have a wonderful day class. Bye-bye.